Cody Co sabotages dates. Okay, so he's Pop still on here. For a new person. This is still yeah, his episode. Yeah. If two people Free can Palestine on a date type for shit. 10 minutes, it went in all nah, expenses paid. My second favorite song is Lift Yourself from Kanye. Nah, bro. My favorite is like, uh, what's I'm it called? Button. Fan. Critic. I don't remember Lift Yourself. Aficionado. I don't Cody really remember. Pro. I don't really remember names of songs like that. I just remember in the albums that they came from. But, uh, All Falls Down is like gotta be number one that's gotta be like the best kanye song bro 100 percent, bro me personally time. that's gotta be my favorite that's, one bro is. my favorite one personally right, what do we do in this episode press the button and reject yourself we'll oh, see how reject they yourself? fare okay hello hi there hold on and reject yourself we'll see how they fare hello Hi there. What's your name? Ryan. Tasty. <laughs> he looks like a Ryan ass nigga, bro. Tasty. Nice he to meet looks you. like a Ryan. Well. <laughs> How you doing? Good. How's your day? It's cool. I think this is the only thing I've done so far. So. Same. I woke yeah. up. Yeah. Do you have a good morning routine? Do you have a good morning routine? I mean, it's a morning routine. It's nothing good. What is it? What's the morning routine? Uh, wake up, hungover, you know, sweating profusely. No, I'm just kidding. Oh, Jesus. No, I'm just oh wow. Kidding. Oh, Are you guys attracted to each other? Is there an attraction there? He has, he has a good sense of humor, though. I like that. Yeah, you're very beautiful. Am I? <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God. You're so... Stop it. Stop it. <laughs> All right, what should I say? She has kids. I don't know if i bring that up. Ty, you have kids, right? I do. I have oh. one. Oh, how old? He's five. First year of kindergarten, or? Yes. Nice. Oh, don't get me started. I'm a little nervous. I'm excited though. Do you want kids? Oh yeah, of course. How many? Ah, uh, like three to eight. This I don't know. Really a lot. No, <laughs> so Ryan, right, you say you see yourself as a daddy? I, yeah, I'd like to be a father. Good morning's a good one. Good morning's a good one. Do you see yourself as a fact. daddy? As a daddy? A daddy. <laughs> I. Uh, I'd say he looks yeah, tall. Honestly, <laughs> <laughs> you know, I want a lady in the streets and a, a freak in the what is it? Lady in the. <laughs> you nailed that. You nailed I <laughs> yeah, my way of words right now are pretty bad. Why? I'm a little nervous. All right, go red. Does your facial hair grow out more than that, or do you keep it low? I it, it rotates depending on the weather. Dang. Sorry, okay. not because. No, it's all good. No, it was just you were nervous. Yeah, no, I am. <laughs> uh, actually, sorry. But you rejected yourself. That's oh. That's the new rule. So I'm out. You're out. Yeah, you've rejected yourself. <laughs> Ryan, get your ass back in here. <laughs> Ryan! Hey, button. <laughs> hey, button. Uh, Yikes. I'm back. Oh, she didn't know she rejected herself. Oh, wow. Yes, yes, sir, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Jen. Nice to meet you. Ryan. Oh, my God. Jen. So, like, do you know anything about the rest of the world, or are you just, like, super American then? Should I be offended right now about this? No, I, okay. are you woke or something? Am I like, woke? Yeah. What do you mean? I'm awake, actually. Okay. I'm not... Ah, what's fucking happening? Oh, I hate this. I hate this. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think of her? She's kind of mean. How tall are you? I'm 4'11". She's back? Wait, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. This, this might be kind of calm. This might be kind of calm. Hold on, let me let me get my fucking thing out, bro. I gotta gotta make sure my fucking fingernails are clipped before we go out. Sure. And a half. You're four eleven. I just say five foot though. Okay, yeah, I'm sure. six two. Good for you. Yeah. How's you know, the air up there? It's different. Jenny, do you go for tall guys now? Uh, yes. All my ex boyfriends are above six two. Above six two. Huh? They like them short. Sure. I don't know what it is. <laughs> I think you don't even know what to say to that. Zero chemistry there. Uh, oh my god. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> no worries. Bro, they're just like eliminating themselves from this nigga, bro. Oh my gosh. All I said the button was it from AI? Nah, I knew it was a person on the other end, but now that I know that no matter who the person is, the button still sounds the same, now I'm starting to think it's not the same person every time, though. You know what I'm saying? Because I thought the button would have sounded different with him being here on the other end of the button type shit. You know what I'm saying? Nah, she is a baddie though. I ain't gonna lie, she is a baddie. She is a baddie. <laughs> bro, this nigga needs to eliminate himself, bro. Like he's 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 scaring all the hoes, bro. Rejected yourself. Bro. I know I did. <laughs> he's scaring all the hoes. Sorry, have a good no. one. Yeah, thank you. Why'd, Why'd you do it? Why'd you do it? Cause I usually can talk a lot, but this one was making me kind of hard to talk. So. Yeah. Bye. What do you think of Ryan? This guy's funny. I'm Ryan. Izzy. Izzy, nice to meet you. Me too. He's scaring all the hoes, bro. Good. Woke up a little bit late, but she's here now. How nice. about you? Yeah, on time. So. Love you guys. Did she just say? Good. Woke up a little bit late, but she's here now. 
She talked to herself in the third person? How nice. about you? Yeah, on time. When was you guys' last relationship? So my last relationship was ended in 2020. You know, COVID happened, everything yeah. fell apart, relationships are expensive. Yeah, my last relationship was over over a year ago. All right, you can turn right. It's just... <laughs> yeah, it's been a while since I've been in a relationship. Bro, why is he like... What's wrong with him? Sorry. Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ryan, explain yourself. I, I'm just not feeling it, I'm sorry. <laughs> Me either, so it's all yeah. good. You wanted out of there. Yeah. Oh my god, what the fuck? <laughs> I think you start laughing. Like date with already. But do you guys know each other? Uh, I don't know if you watched the last episode we were in, but we were definitely sitting in the same position. How did it go last time? He rejected me last time. Let's think about it. To you be fair. <laughs> rejected me based off my sign. What's your sign? I'm a Capricorn. I don't remember this. What the? God fuck? damn it. Where's the button? Nope. Mm, nope. <laughs> Just because he's a Capricorn? Hold on, miss. I would say that we Capricorns are actually pretty cool people. You know what I'm saying? I would say that, me, that us Capricorns are actually... Let's go one to ten. I would say I'd put a Capricorn at a solid eight. That's like the floor. Like that's the lowest a Capricorn can even be. Me personally, I'm just saying. What's your sign? I'm a, I'm a Capricorn. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't blame her. <laughs> I see. Thank you. <laughs> From what I remember, you really thought that was weird that people would reject people, right? Do you yeah, think yeah. that? So. Yeah, I, I think it's weird. Is it different this time? Any, any sparks? I mean, it's more awkward, awkward right this time it's than more last awkward this time. time than anything, yeah. More awkward this Best. time. Especially because now that we know who each other are, we have a lot of mutual friends as well, so we know a lot of the same people. Have fun. Pleasure seeing you again. That didn't feel uncomfortable at all. Yes, uncomfortable, but like, I mean, uncomfortable situations are bound to happen. It's kind of just the way of things. That's, that's deep. Type shit. Maven, nice to meet you. Natalia, nice to meet Natalia? you. Natalia? Natalia. So I'm used to Seattle, so what do you do for fun here? I mean, Seattle has a little bit of everything and anything, because it's like, you got the city, then you have nature. Uh, I'm more of a city boy. Thank but, um, God, because I had like a situation ship and he was not a city boy. He was a farmer boy. Oh. He was like, I like country music. And I was like, nah, I'm oh, not a I'm sorry, but I just can't. I think there's a little chemistry here. What do you think? You guys should like dance bit. together right now. You guys got music? Or is you guys got disco? I'm oh, down. Oh, disco. I'm down. <laughs> I'm about to stand you know what? All right. Oh, that's cute. Go red. She's split between like red to like Moses. No, nah, that's facts. Two or three? Wait, who? She? She's a two or three? Nah, bro. Stop, bro. Stop. She's not. She's not a two or three. The last girl, yeah, I'd probably say she was like. I said the last girl was like a like a five, maybe a four. Go red again, maybe? I'm done. <laughs> so, oh. what, what, like, what's your favorite thing to do here in Seattle? Like, because I love kayaking. What the hell? This is great. Like, there is a nature aspect, so like the, the hikes are cool, but like uh, besides that, like going to art shows. I'm currently selling my breast milk. Is that something? Fun fact, Natalia is currently selling her breast milk. <laughs> Wait, wait, why though? Like, is, is, is she making, is she making money off of that? <laughs> no, the other girl? Oh, okay, yeah, 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 type shit, type shit, type shit. I, I agree with that, I agree with that. <laughs> I agree with that take. It started as a joke. Okay. We were at a party. Okay. And then like, I just started giving people my breast milk to try and they were like, oh, you know, your breast milk tastes good. You should sell it. <laughs> what do you sell it to? I sold it to my best friend's brother and he just took it from there. And I don't know the individuals, <laughs> but they give me money. So that's all you I know care what? about. I respect the fuck out of that. Maven, would you ever taste some? <laughs> taste the mommy milkers? Uh... <laughs> Sure, why not? I why bet you better. Cause like, <laughs> better. I need, yes, I need a review. I need a review it's for them. Are you guys oh. feeling this right now? Is there some chemistry going on? I like talking to you. Yeah, I like vibing with you. Yeah. All right, cool. Yeah. I mean, I don't know though. Like, you know, I am a mom. So, okay. like, how do you feel about that, Maven? I'm not pressing it at all. All right, listen, I think things are going pretty well. I'm going to turn red again. So, you have one more chance to hit it. I'm putting my hands up here. 
She wants to press it. She wants to press it, bro. See, I knew it. I fucking knew it, bro. She wanted to press that shit, bro. I knew it. I knew it, bro. Damn, why? I mean, I didn't get to ask the questions that I really want to know, so I don't really know. What yeah, the no, fuck? True. But I like my- Then ask him! I like with you. I like vibing with you, too. I like dancing with you. It's all right. Hey, pleasure. <laughs> nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. <laughs> what the fuck? She's a vibe. What's up? What's vibing? I heard you wanted somebody's titty milk, so I'm not going to shake your hand. <laughs> Whoa! Was there context behind that? Mm, I trust my girls. Wait, what, what was, was your problem? problem that he said titty milk? I just support her hustle. Stop the hustle! <laughs> oh, you yeah, see, that's why it's context. Okay, give me context, let's go. She sells titty milk. And apparently it started off as a joke with her homies, and then she sold it to her homie's brother. So she offered the titty milk. She, it it kind of got offered, put on the table. Not like literally. <laughs> you know, I'm not gonna even gonna hate, hate you on it, because right. I probably look you come, come on, see, <laughs> right, right. I thought you outright was like, oh, you a mom? Let me try that titty milk. No, I'd be like, no, 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 no. Mary hasn't had sex in a year. That is true. <laughs> this nigga went red immediately after saying that. Nah, that's crazy. That's crazy. Oh, why? The only reason why is because I'm low-key invested in trying the titty milk, bro. You know, you go support that mom. I support I'm that. I'm low-key invested in it. Well, it was nice meeting you. A pleasure. Yeah. Go get that titty milk. <laughs> support our local moms. <laughs> what the our fuck our is happening? <laughs> Hi. Good, how are you? Good. You been buzzing people out? Only one, oh. and technically they buzz themselves out. Oh, is that what we're doing right now? Yeah. Buzzing ourselves out. Abdul does not fuck with vegetables. Wait, why? Okay, grown ass man not liking vegetables is kind of crazy. I'm not gonna lie, like not liking vegetables is like some like middle school to like junior year of high school type shit. Like junior year of high school, you should start trying vegetables at that point. Unless you don't play sports at all, then fuck it, whatever. But being a grown ass man, having a high school degree, diploma, and you're still like, yo, I don't like vegetables, bro. Come on, bro. Grow the fuck up, bro. Grow the fuck up and eat some goddamn vegetables, bro. I'm, I swear on everything, them shits do not taste that bad, bro. Now, me personally, there are some vegetables that I just don't eat. Like, if I'm eating squash, that shit is disgusting. I'll eat mushrooms on accident. I'll, uh,. I can fuck up some asparagus, it just needs to be in a certain way, because asparagus kind of has a bit of a taste, an aftertaste to it that I don't like, unless I, uh, I have to mix it with something, like, if I'm eating asparagus and steak, chef's kiss, but if I'm eating asparagus with, like, water, you know what I'm saying, there's a bit of a difference, like, celery, I fuck with celery and wings, I fuck with, um, carrots are great vegetable, oh my gosh, we already have a vegetable tier list up on the channel, you know what I'm saying, uh, if you guys wanted to search for that, I don't think there's a tier list playlist yet. I I do have to make that. I'll uh I'll I'll break down and uh end up making one of those one day. Uh, but dude, like, it, it it's honestly like great. I'm not gonna lie, it's it's great, it's great. But yeah, that that's uh that's basically like where my head's at with all that. Mm, you know that's real. Vegetables are great. I actually don't fuck with bean sprouts, I and I'm getting said bean sprouts to me and that's like a core component to pho yeah. i feel like i'm about to get a lot of hate for the Vietnamese people. <laughs> side story when i was growing up my brother hella hated vegetables mm -hmm. and there's like this vietnamese soup where you put spinach in it and he would try to like pretend to yak so that way i would have to eat it or he would just not have to eat it at all i do have a story about spinach and spinach nah bro spinach bro you put some spinach in your eggs bro like, you crack open, like, maybe four to five eggs, three to four. You know what I'm saying? We're in a recession. Or not a recession. We're, uh, the, uh, there's a lot of inflation going on. Um, so three to four eggs, right? You crack them up, chop them up. You know what I'm saying? You mixing it up, all that shit, right? And then you, uh, throw some spinach on top. Oh, my God, bro. That shit tastes so fucking good, bro. You throw some goddamn salt, some Himalaya pink salt. Some pepper on that bitch, some seasoned salt on that bitch. Oh my god, that shit tastes good as fuck. Eggs and eggs and spinach is a great ass, you know what I'm saying? That's a great fucking breakfast to start off your morning, bro. If I could have that shit every morning, I would. Vomit, actually. Funny that you bring all mm, that up. I don't know if I'm ready for that. <laughs> in five years, <laughs> I'll be the captain. Uh, all right, hold on. Younger, my sister got in trouble for something, and my mom was really, really angry. Mm. And as my sister was getting scolded, I was in the corner eating my spinach, uh, and I threw up in the spinach. And then she came back over here. She's like, Abdul, why haven't you finished your food? 
and I just fucking ate my vomit spinach. You ate your own vomit? I did. <laughs> this is like, I think I was like seven years old. That's metal as fuck. <laughs> honestly, honestly, yeah. You want someone who smells good. Do you want him to give her a little whiff? <laughs> I, I, hate, I hate when y'all do that. <laughs> I do like someone that smells good. What about you guys giving each other like a, you know, a little sniff? You know, I'm not gonna lie, I had me a little bit of champagne in the back. <laughs> and it was a little warm back there, but I did put on deodorant. <laughs> you can smell my arm. I consent to that. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Good smelling arm. What kind of lotion is that? Oh my god. Would you like to smell my arm? Sure. I don't think it smells like anything, but. <laughs> it smells like human. Thank you. <laughs> it smells fuck? neutral. Are you two attracted to each other? I don't think I have a smell to me though, chat. Do y'all do y'all have a smell? Like it, like if y'all walk into a room, do people just know who you are based on the smell of you? Because I got a couple friends that have a smell to them. Like natural scent. Like it don't matter what kind of cologne deodorant they got on i could smell underneath that bro and it like and they have a natural smell to them but i don't think i have one because I, I i'm pretty sure i would smell myself right unless i i mean i'm with myself all day so i guess i wouldn't know that because i'd have to call somebody say so i would say so well i don't know anybody who sees me every single day who like smells me though because i've been wearing cologne and shit to work so like i don't know if niggas I don't know. I'm chatting. TikTok told me I was fucking yapping, bro. Every Like, a lot of the videos I be posting now on TikTok, bro, they always be saying I'm yapping. They're like, oh my gosh. Posted a whole yap session. Yapper, yapper, yapping, yapping. I'm like, what? I'm not a yapper, bro. I just, I just, I just be chatting with y'all, bro. It's called, the, the section that we're in is just chatting. As well. Am I not supposed to talk good. no more? The light up is fresh, the curls are curly. He smells like a human. <laughs> I smell. He does, True. you know, it's like not too salty, so you got not split too in between sweet, like just right in the middle. I'm gonna go red one more time. No one hits it, then we're off to the races. Sitting on my hands. I'm not sitting on my hands, but they're cut. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna go for the second day. Dave and Buster's? I was thinking uh, there's a good Ethiopian restaurant in the central I district. I am hella down. It just opened a couple months ago. I'll be at Dave and Buster's. <laughs> Thank you for watching me voice the button. It's been a long time coming. So many people have asked. One day you'll be a guest voice on the button. Also, you know, that's weird opinion. I think Cody should voice the button. I feel like that would be so hilarious. Sounds more human now. Convince the end of the series they'll reveal Cody as the actual voice. Asked for this and it finally happened. Thank you guys for inviting me. I really appreciate it. I hope everyone liked it, and uh, let's do this again. Thank you, Cody. Yeah. Did I win? Yeah. You won. Yeah. I can go. <laughs> it was me. I was the one. I was the one voicing it today. <laughs> That's why I said Austin. <laughs> What's up? Thanks for bearing with me today. Sure. <laughs> uh, I just I watch a lot of the videos online, so. Oh, did it? See, I know. I was like, are they gonna hate me? I don't know. Yeah, sure. Can you take a picture? Sure, yeah. Okay. Dude, it was so hard. I mean, like, I did a bad job. I feel like, I don't know. I was stressed the whole time. It was fun, though. It was cool. Nice to meet you guys. I don't have, like, a pose, though, chat. Like, whenever people, like, tell me to, like, uh, whenever we're taking pictures and shit, like, me and the, me and the homies and shit, like, niggas be like, oh, like, let's flick up or whatever. Like, I don't have a pose. Like, I be thinking about doing, like, the Nico pose where I'm just like, but then, like, a lot of the times I'll just be like, like I'll just be, I'll just be standing there like these, like you know, what I'm saying? just like just like standing there, like just post it up, just just no smile, none of that shit. Or like I would just be like, huh. you know, what I'm saying like like type shit. Like I don't have a smile, bro. Like I just don't smile on some shit. Like I don't do that shit. So like it's kind of hard for me to, you know, what I'm saying. Is that guy Ethiopian? He don't look like it. Nah, hell no. His forehead is nowhere near big enough to be Ethiopian. But he said an Ethiopian restaurant though. Um, if I had to guess, I'd say like he's he's some sort of Middle Eastern though. I don't think he's African at all. Or may he might be Somalian, actually. Not 100% sure. This is a good video, though. I don't have a pose. I, I need to find one, though. I need to find one. So that way I can actually start posting pictures on Instagram and shit like that. Wait, did he watch his own video of him voicing the button? That is... Fire. Wait, Cody and Co. Nigga put his name as the That's genius. I'm not gonna lie, I have another channel name idea. I'm not gonna lie. I have another channel name. It's gonna be like my second second channel.